Hi, I'm Ian Cole, bringing you an IAQA tech tip on residential HVAC systems. If you're an indoor air quality professional that works on single family homes, you'll need to understand some of the basics of residential HVAC systems. However, as you travel around North America, you'll find a wide range of equipment and controls used to cool and heat homes. On the cooling side, you may find split systems, heat pumps, packaged units, sleeve and window units, mini splits, and even evaporative coolers. On the heating side, you may find furnaces, boilers, heat pumps, space heaters, electric baseboard, wood-burning stoves, or solar-based systems. And you might see fuels being used, such as natural gas, propane, fuel oil, or just electricity. You might find ductwork made out of sheet metal, ductboard, or flexible duct. You might find the air handling unit in the occupied space, or in an attic, a crawl space, a basement, or an attached garage. Here's the main point of this video. Each of these different systems and pieces of equipment come with its own impact on indoor air quality. It's important to understand these air quality implications, especially for systems common in your area. To learn more about residential HVAC, consider taking a one-hour class in the IAQA University titled Residential HVAC. Visit the IAQA website for more information.